Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to film two different videos. I did my foundation, highlight, and contour routine, and then the second video that'll be out this week will be my eyes and my lips. So yeah, um, I went in with all drugstore for this entire look, face and eyes. Um, so I really hope you guys enjoy this. I'm just now starting to kind of shop around and buy more drugstore with getting into doing these beauty videos. Um, so look forward to that. And yeah, so let's just jump right in and I will show you guys how I I do my foundation, highlight, and contour routine. Okay, so to start off with this look, I'm going to go in with my NYX color correcting liquid that is illuminating and my pore filler. So I know this is the first time you're seeing my bare face. Don't be scared. This is actually the best it's ever looked. So now I'm going to go in with my L'Oreal foundations. One is really dark, one is really light. I just mix them to get my perfect shade. And now I'm going to go in with my Morphe foundation brush. I just got this this past month and I am loving it. It literally busts out my foundation so quick. I'm all about that. So now after I get this all buffed in, I am going to go in with my BH Cosmetics pressed powder foundation. Just with that same brush, I just wiped off my excess foundation and I'm just going to set my foundation with that. I will have all of the items listed down below that I used. So now I'm gonna go in with my concealer. This is the Maybelline Master Concealer. I love this stuff so much, it blends out so nice. So now I'm going to use a damp beauty blender and I'm going to focus this underneath my eyes in kind of a triangle form and then I'm going to put a little bit on my chin, the bridge of my nose, and my forehead. These are all of the points that the high points of your face that the sun would normally hit so that is where you want to focus your highlight when you are highlighting and contouring your face. Then of course I'm just going to go in and blend all of this out. I have just been recently using a damp beauty blender and I actually really love this one. This is the Real Techniques beauty blender. So now I'm going to go in with the Ulta Contour Kit and I am going to use this yellow shade. It's got kind of a highlighty, lustery feel to it. I need to find a matte drugstore setting powder, but for now this will be fine. So I'm just going to set all of the places that I placed my concealer. Now I'm going to pick up this BH Cosmetics palette and just use these two shades. This yellow shade is more matte, so that's why I decided to go in and do that. Basically same thing. So now I'm going to go in with my Morphe E55 brush. This is my favorite, favorite brush to contour my nose, which is what I'm doing here. And then I'm going to brush the excess product underneath my bottom lip. Yep, there goes the top of my brush. <laughs> Good old Morphe brushes sometimes fall apart, that's okay. They're cheap, so no big deal. So anyway, tap off excess, and then I'm going to draw two lines on either side of my nose. In my opinion, you know, my nose is it's not large, but it's obviously not a tiny button nose, which is totally fine. So of course, I'm going to go in and contour my nose. And now I'm going to go in and just kind of draw two lines of where if I actually had to find cheekbones, that's where it would be. So that's the whole point of contouring is to kind of make your face look a little more defined. Now I'm going to go in and draw two lines on the top of my forehead. My forehead is actually really small, so I don't usually need to do this. I just do it to kind of wrap around my cheek contour. 
So now I'm just gonna go in and blend everything out so it's all seamless and flawless. So here I'm just going to take those lighter shades I was using to just kind of define and clean up the bottom half of the contour. Sometimes it gets a little bit messy and you get a little bit of fallout. So I just go in and kind of correct that and touch up anything that I need to with the highlight shades. So for blush, I'm going to go in with my BH Cosmetics blush palette. I'm going to go in with these two bottom shades and just kind of mix them together. The one on the left is a little more shimmery, which is totally fine. It kind of goes along with the glowy theme. But yeah, that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you made it to the end, you're a champion. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't. And if you are new to my channel, welcome, and I will see you in my next video.